What is up guys? Welcome to another video here. Doing something different. I am out on the big lake in search of some toothy critters. Um, water temps have just kept skyrocketing. It's been kind of a bummer. Anytime there's rain in Wisconsin, my neck of the woods just does not get hit. Um, so obviously the water temps are a lot higher in the northwoods where I am. So, you know, I'm gonna give the muskies a little break and go for the 40 inch gator. I know they live in this body of water. I've seen pictures, I've heard the rumors that there's some giant fish up here. I'm just gonna take some of my musky baits and go for some giant pike here. Um, I don't know, I'm just gonna start off on this little rock pile. It's not that little, it's actually kind of a big spot, but uh, there's cabbage on the edge of this rock pile, so it's gotta be a dang good spot for some pike. It's next to deep water. Um, there's bait around it, so just gonna go from there, throw some musky baits. I'm sure these fish do not see much uh, casting lures, so I'm pumped. Uh, I've been meaning to do this all summer long, and now this is the perfect time. Got water temps of 71 up here, and uh, yeah, definitely encroaching that 80 degree mark um, on the inland lake. So that's my game plan. Uh, wish me luck here. I want to catch a giant 40 inch pike. That's the goal. That is the goal today. I know they're out here. All righty, just pulled out this Medusa out of the Lakewoods Magnum. Love that tackle box. Just uh, goes everywhere with me. <laughs> nice thing about it, uh, when I when it's in the boat, I know I have everything I need. I got all my tools right in there. Easy access. They're not laying, getting rusty. That goes into my truck every night, uh, just to you know keep all my all my tools all nice and uh, perfect, but I'm gonna start off throwing a mini Medusa. I don't think these fish have ever seen a rubber bait before. You know pike love them. They absolutely do love Medusas, so. Let's see how clear the water is. It's clear. Oh my gosh, is this gonna be cool. Yeah, maybe I'll catch some smallmouth on this thing. But yeah, this is a SWAT uh, 2020 salt stick. Uh, I can kind of see the, uh, I guess I can see the weeds out there a bit. Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm on St. Clair right now. Oh, this is wild. All right, wish me luck. We got some high bait here too. Oh boy, I'm pumped. Come on, giant, giant pike. I'd rather do that than muskies right now. Come on, no. Oh my gosh. Wow, my GoPro is not recording. What just happened? Brand new bait. Brand new bait just got sliced. First, second cast. I was not recording, of course. Jeez, I just couldn't believe it. it was the second pump. Well, that's a good sign. Uh, first pike bite of the day. There we go. Come on. There's a gator. There's a nice gator. Look at that thing. That's so pretty. That is so pretty. I got him. <laughs> it just came off. Oh my gosh. Look at that fat little thing. Sweet. That axe from three now. What a gorgeous looking pike right there. I think there's bigger ones here. I'm not sure why I even had this guy, but guys, check this out. It's a beautiful looking pike. But look at that. Who's out there? Mama, look how big that bite mark is. That is a flipping big pike that tried to eat this guy. Wow, he's got some damage on the fin there. Look at that tail. That's insane looking. A 40, 40 plus incher from here would look so cool. Oh my gosh, there's a giant around these parts. Look at that bite mark. Super cool. Super cool. That's the pike splash. <laughs> there we go. Okay. There's some pike in the spot. <laughs> a little bit bigger than the last one. Ate right at my feet. Oh my gosh, this is interesting. Didn't need to touch him. Just ripping that Medusa through the weeds. Guess I can show you guys kind of the structure that I'm fishing. Just a straggly kind of cabbage you'll find on the Great Lakes. It reminds me of 
Lake St. Clair quite a bit. So, wow, I'm pumped, I'm pumped. Things are working out. Man, that just gets me so excited seeing those bite marks on that smaller pike. Uh, that means mama's somewhere. <laughs> go come on feels good staying down ah oh, get out of the weeds there's a good one just gobbled that medusa you know what he's not that big that's a cool fish though gosh these things are just absolutely gorgeous there we go that's a nice gator that is a beautiful pike i mean i can't even can't even imagine what a big one looks like that's so flipping cool look at those blues dang that's awesome you're good buddy Woo. so cool just uh been a little lull in the action i checked out some other spots that you know i was curious about but i just got on to a big weed line here and uh, just ripping through cabbage and so flipping cool of catching Great Lakes pike uh, you know a matter of time it's gonna be the right one there we go oh there's a good one there's a good one there's a good one. Get out of those weeds. Oh, he's in the weeds. There's a good one. All right. There's a fat one. Oh my gosh. Why is my neck getting caught up? Oh my gosh. Just amateur hour on all these net shops. All right, let's take a look at this guy. There's a beautiful, beautiful Great Lakes pike here. Just awesome colorings on them. Jeez, these things are flipping cool. I don't even know if this one's 30 inches or not. Just touching, wow. <laughs> 29, I just wanted to get a grasp of what these fish really are. Uh, gonna put them back now. All right. You ready buddy gosh look at that beautiful pike man Whew. all right well i'm definitely get on a program here find the weeds snap some rubber catch some fish so now it's just a matter of getting that upper 30 class fish i'm so pumped though this is so cool finally one of my plans come together um hasn't came together quite yet Got to get a big girl on film here today, but super cool. Nonetheless, I think four pike or so. <sighs> I just want that big one. There you go. There we go. Next cast. Oh boy. This one feels good. Staying down. Oh, good head shakes. Oh yeah, good head shakes. Oh yeah. Oh, I just hooked on the side a little more. <laughs> Here I thought it was a big, big one, but uh, just another mean fat one. <laughs> Gosh, they're loaded in this spot. Just had a slice of pizza, got back to casting. And uh, I think my second cast after that last one. There we go there we go sweet gosh they are in the weeds hell yeah mini medusa pike just love medusas in the weeds man oh man is that cool probably never seen anything like it so sweet all right moving on
Oh, yes. Oh, okay. Wow, this thing's taking me. This thing's taking me. That was quite the bite. This thing's taking me. Oh yeah, that's what I'm after. That's what I'm after. That's a good fish. That's a really good one. That's a really good one. Just dogging me. Oh my gosh, under the boat. You done, girl? Got her. Yes! That's what we're after, folks. That's a dandy. That's a dandy Great Lakes fish. Just absolutely destroyed that Medusa. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. <laughs> Look at that. The head of the Medusa is gone. Heck, yeah. Okay. Check out that gator. There's an awesome fish right there. That is what we're after. A Great Lakes good one. And they get so much bigger than this. That's the crazy part. Oh my gosh, how big are you? <laughs> Only a 33 inch here, but uh, put up an awesome fight. Great build on these fish. And uh, they get so much bigger than this. That's, that's awesome. You're probably going to be just good to go, aren't you? That's awesome to find uh, a decent one. Uh, new spot, a little bit deeper cabbage. Oh, rubber bites on pike just never get old. Um, maybe when you're musky fishing, but uh, when you're actually going for them, it's so much fun. Oh my gosh. Another good one, another good one, another good one. That one's not hooked good. That's not hooked good. That's not hooked good. Eight right at my feet. Got him, and he's off. Woo, another 30 plus incher. Heck yeah. All right, it's go time. All righty, another sweet, sweet fish here. Holy cow, It's this is getting fun now. Uh, I think it's a little bit shorter than the other one. Yeah, 31, but just a little bit beefier, isn't he? Yes, this is so cool. Where's the 40? Yeah, you're gonna kick off just fine, aren't you, buddy? Gosh, that's so sweet. Back to the weeds you go, bud. Oh, all right, sun is setting and the fish are biting. There we go, another one. Gosh, they're biting now. I'm just gonna keep myself spot locked here. Just a little shaker. All right, another quality pike. It's just so stout. Bye bye, bud. All right, I guess I'm just gonna keep myself spot locked in this location. That's uh, quite a few pike in a little tiny spot. There we go. Not a big one. Not a big one. <laughs> okay. Bye bye. <laughs> Guess that's how we're doing it. Just uh, roll back to those icons where uh, I was catching uh, those better fish for sunset here. And uh, that's all I got, I guess. Another smaller one. The spot screams big fish. It certainly helps getting a couple nicer ones, not giants, but uh, two low 30 inch fish sitting in the same spot. Makes me feel like there could definitely be a 40 inch somewhere in this weed bed. Well, folks, that's going to wrap up my day uh, chasing trophy gators. 
it was it was fun to uh go do this again uh, i haven't been on this body of water in uh, a couple months or so so it's cool seeing it in the summertime i'm pumped to get back out here because i think i'm on to something explored a lot of different areas and i think uh had sunset here found the right area what i should be looking for so i'm pumped i'm pumped to get back up here that was a blast catching them catching pike on rubber uh when you're going for them it is super fun they just inhale baits and uh i don't know it, it was fun to do something different but anyways guys uh thank you so much for coming by uh it was fun to do something different up here in the northwoods i uh, can't wait to go back please hit that subscribe button and we'll see you on the next video